Does your GoPro die quickly when it's cold out? Hi everyone, Jason here. Today I'm gonna to show you how to get way better performance in cold weather with your GoPro. Stick around to the end and I'll show you how you can get much better performance with your blue batteries or if you have an older camera like the GoPro. So here I have my GoPro Hero 10 and a blue battery that it came with. Before I upgraded to this camera, I had a GoPro Hero 8, and I could barely get 20 minutes of 4K recording when it was really cold out. So the solution to the problem was to upgrade to the Enduro battery. They're white instead of blue. Unfortunately, the GoPro Hero 8 doesn't accept these batteries. You have to go to the Hero 9 and up. So yes, I upgraded to the Hero 10 just to get better cold weather performance with my batteries. So after testing for the last year or so, I can confirm that these white Enduro batteries, they last way longer when it's cold. I can go all day with the same two batteries and I usually fill up my memory card, a 64 gigabyte SD card before I have to pop in one of the blue batteries. They're not perfect though. They are much better, but their performance still is worse in the cold than it is when it's hot. Say if you're using it on a warm day, plus two degrees, or if you're using them for dirt biking in the summer. Here's some tips for those cold days. Avoid riding around with your camera mounted on your helmet, but not recording. Let's say you have a long ride from the truck to your riding area. Keep the camera in your chest pocket where it's warm. I keep my camera behind my display on my snowmobile where it's heated. And when I get to the riding area, then I take it out and mount it to my helmet and start recording. So if you have a GoPro Hero 8, you can still get pretty good battery life with the blue batteries. But again, keep the batteries in your pocket or somewhere warm. When you're ready to record, take the camera out, mount it to your helmet or to your chesty, record. And if you're gonna take a break for a while, say a lunch break, take the camera off your helmet, put it back in your pocket. This can be a bit uncomfortable, having your camera and your batteries in your pockets, keeping them warm when you also have your transceiver. That's where your avalanche pack clasps and your zipper, all of that stuff's in the same area but you will notice better life. I used the GoPro Hero Session, this is the original for many years in cold weather, and it doesn't even have a battery that's replaceable. Luckily with the GoPro Session, it had a frame that you could just pop the camera out, put it in your pocket, keep it warm, ready to record, put it back in the frame, hit the button and record. The only issue I had with this one, not 4K, no hyper smooth, the image was quite shaky. Well, hello, can I help you? Fergus wants to know if you're finding this content helpful. Hit that like button, subscribe, it's gonna help us out a lot. There you go. All right, everyone, hopefully you found that helpful.